Welcome back to the channel. I'm still alive. I haven't done much on the channel, but I'm at PRI this year, and I don't want to be one of those influencers. That, there's a million other guys that are doing PRI videos, but I'm a stick guy. If you've been watching my channel for a while, um, I've done some stuff on Drag Race Clutch Science, and this is a product that I wanted to showcase that I think fits really well with the technical content of my, of my channel. So this is the Bangship Billy. It's a uh, hydraulic clutch controller that allows you to have like a slipper clutch that's adjustable with just your cell phone, uh, which is just awesome. So if you've been watching my channel, you've seen me like on Drag Week adjusting my clutch, you know, uh, twice a day, and you've seen me with the GTO and, and crawling underneath the car. This you can do it in the comfort of your driver's seat with just your cell phone. So I'm going to hand it off to Bill Armstrong, my friend here, stick car legend, <laughs> to explain it. Hi, so this is the... Uh Bankship Billy digital clutch controller. Um, in the kit, you get a Bluetooth controller with the hydraulic portion, so the manifold, and the hydraulic cartridge, and that wiring harness. The rest of this is just to demonstrate how it works. But basically, it allows a diaphragm style clutch to operate like a slipper clutch at the drag strip on the launch only, and you make adjustments to it with an app on your phone instead of crawling into the car. So, if you want to slip in here, I'll show you. Ah, did you hear that? Come slip in here. <laughs> so, you do have to have a clutch switch. Um, that is the one part you need to provide, and that's super important. But basically, when you push the clutch down, and if you're not using an aftermarket EC, we're going to utilize the master switch to arm this. And when you're ready to launch it, you launch it. It goes right to the, I call it the bite point, or the engagement point of the clutch. And then it will hold it there to slip the clutch and then release it. So right now I have it set up for about seven tenths of a second, and it's not gonna. It's gonna slip it for like that amount of time. Which realistically, if you look at data logs for a slipper clutch, that's about as long as you're slipping those as well. So, any questions? What's the website? Uh, Bankshipbilly.com. All right. Thanks a lot, Billy. Thanks.